Hi everyone, welcome to chendu.org. In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate to you how Excel School Online Classroom Learning Experience works. So when you join Excel School, I will be emailing you your secure login ID, password and online URL where you can get into the classroom. So once you visit that URL, this is the page where you will end up. It will ask you for your username and password. So let us get into that. I have set up a test account with both username and password. If you were, would like to keep you logged into the classroom, you can just click on this remember me so that your session will be preserved. So once you log in, you will be ending up in a place called welcome. This is a welcome page where I introduce myself and I give some notices to the students and I enter, I enter and I ask you to say hello to the rest of the class. So this is introduction page, nothing special here. The most important pages in Excel school are this one, the latest lessons, the lesson index and Excel dashboards and a few more will be added here. So let us get to the lesson index page first. Lesson index page is where you will see all the lessons in Excel school arranged neatly in a logical order that I recommend you to view. So if you see this, you will see that there are a bunch of lessons grouped under Excel formulas, under Excel formatting, charting, let us say, you know, importing external data, data filters or pivot tables and tables like that. So each topic has a bunch of lessons beneath it and they are arranged in the order that I recommend you to watch. If a lesson is an advanced lesson that requires some expert skills or uses some advanced concepts, it is marked so. So you can skip that if you are not comfortable or you can just jump to the advanced lessons if you are already a ninja in some of these basic things. So let us click through one of these lessons. Let us go to conditional formatting 2. Once you go to a lesson, the format of lesson pages is again consistent. What you see is it all all the lesson pages start with this section, what is in this lesson, where I explain the topics of the lessons through bullet points. So I say, you know, we go through advanced conditional formatting options, we learn how to use icons, data bars, heat maps, and we try to highlight top five above average, etc. And then a big block of area where you can view the lesson. Now this has a play button and this block usually appears uh, within 20, 30 seconds of loading page because this thing take some time to load and you will see it finished before uh, otherwise it will be a rotating circle icon or something depending on your browser then beneath the video you will see a couple of download links download links for excel workbooks and download links for the lesson video now lesson video download link may not be available to you if you are uh, not part of an online dashboards or download package but uh, usually the, all these links, other links are available to you. So you can download the workbook and watch the lesson online. So let us go ahead and play this one. When you click the play button, it will take some time to buffer the lesson. It, the lesson has to be loaded from my web server. And once it finished loading, it will start automatically playing. And you can see this white progress bar going all the way to the end. So you, what you will see in most cases is an Excel window here. And where you will see me using Excel and you will hear me talking in the background. So here is a little tip for you. If you click on this middle button that looks like a document button, you will see all the topics in the lesson. So you can jump to anything. For example, you can jump to this one to ha know how to use conditional formatting to highlight top three values. Similarly, you can jump to this one to see the conclusions. So this is a very quick way to jump through the lesson topics without uh, you know, if you already know how to use above average values and things like that then you can jump to heat maps. Once you finish watching the lesson you can ask a question here you know, for example let us say we talk about all these top five above average. How to highlight top five items okay or let us say top five is already discussed. So you can ask the question, how do I highlight top bottom, bottom five items? And if you submit this, your comment will appear here as a question. And in a half day or a day, I'll come back to you with a proper answer or maybe ask you a follow-up question. Now you can check this box while commenting so that you will get an email when somebody posts a reply to you or somebody asks a follow-up question. 
all the lesson topics that are available are also listed on the sidebar area so that you can jump to a particular topic for example you can jump to class projects to see the both class projects that are available to you and work on them or something like that you can see advanced formulas <coughs> so that all the advanced formula lessons are shown here you can also use this latest lessons page to access the latest lessons now latest lessons page is not arranged in logical order it is a chronological order so on january 5th i made this posting if on january 10th i make a new article explaining about let us say something else in dashboards you will see that on the top so this is a page where you may want to uh, log in and watch once in a while to see if there are any new lessons but you probably don't have to worry about this because you will anyway get a newsletter whenever there is a new lesson if you would like to modify your membership details for example if you want to modify your password or email address or the way your name is displayed you can click on the membership details link in that previous page and change any of these things for example email address or modify your password you can even include some biographical information or other details which are not mandatory when you click the update profile button you will profile will be updated so that you can use the new password <coughs> so i hope this short demo has helped you visualize how excel school works i hope to see you in excel school because i enjoy making you awesome in excel so that you can do much more with the free time that you gain and become even more empowered and recognized for what you do thank you very much for your time and this is chandu from chandu.org you have a great day bye bye